it's the first time today, you know, I actually make some laps. We did a little jump in a couple days ago, but uh, first time today, get around the track, and uh, it's amazing the horsepower on those things. You know, I set my goals to get out of Pro Light and try to move up, and uh, we'll be doing both Pro Light and Pro 2, so we have five races this weekend at Crandon, and uh, I mean, we're going to test ourselves, see what we can do, you know, and just trying to get our feet wet for next year. We'll be either in the Pro 2 or Pro 4. my 20th year will be 20 years in pro light seven championships working on an eighth and uh numerous wins but i mean our goal is we ain't getting any youngers we want to get up and race the big boys ross hook pro 2 number 21. came out last year and and uh, been working on building our pro 2 program and and uh, came out last year and got the whole shot here at crandon and had a dozen screaming maniacs behind me chasing me down and we were able to hang on to the world championship win on saturday and, um, you know, we've really focused hard this year on getting our program to that same level against, you know, 16 guys this year instead of instead of eight good guys last year. And you know, we got our got our truck all ready to go, and we're we're planning on defending our world championship title next weekend. Yeah, it's the big one. The biggest thing for me is Saturday's race. It's the world championship. That's the race of all races. Everybody wants to be the world champion. You can't get crowned world champion anywhere but Crandon on Saturday. So Sunday is just another class race. You know, it's no big deal, just an ABC race, live TV, you know, nothing. But Saturday is the race I want to go out and win. Kurt Leduc called it the Angry Dutchman. And that's just the way it's going to be. Uh, we're going to do whatever it takes to get to the front. Who's ever in front of us, look out because we're coming through. Yeah, this weekend is going to be tough. You know, you got everyone's making a, a big splash about Robbie Gordon. Robbie's always fast. Uh, I think this this course is going to favor him a lot because it gives him more room. It's uh, you know, Robbie likes to run really, really heavy on the throttle. He'll obviously come with a big motor, and uh, but I think a lot of the guys that have been here, you know, you got last last year's world champion Ross Hook. Um, you got Dan Vanderhoel's been running very fast. Todd Todd LeDuc just won. Rob McCackrin's always there. Jeremy McGrath's fast. And I feel like we got our program, you know, at the Red Bull Bosch Power Tools. Uh, Kumo Tire Ford is, is running good. I, I think we're right at where we need to be. We've done some work with Charlie from ATD. Um, obviously, the motors, uh, Roush Yates Power, um, and Fox Shocks. I think we have we have a great package. So now it's just a matter of the driver not to uh, not to make too many mistakes. This is the race when it comes to short course racing. If you want to win a race, if you can pick one all year long, you want to win the big one. If you're only going to get to win one, you want to win the big one. And that's what everybody's out here trying to do. There's probably eight to ten guys that can win either class, and it's just, it's been nothing but great racing the whole way. You know, the competition yellow being involved, and it's just, you know, it's 15 minutes of pure hell. You know, maybe that's why Crandon is, is what it is. It's bittersweet and has the biggest crowds, and, you know, everybody's seen both sides of it, the mean side, and, and once you experience the joys of it, you know, you can't can't compare it to anything. So, you know, we're coming here, we want to win, and uh, yeah, no one's going to hold anything back. So that's what's going to be so great about this race. You know, no one's going to come in here and, and points race or do any of that. Everybody's coming in here to win the race, and it's going to make an exciting weekend for the fans. If you're a short course off-road racing fan and you miss this race, you're going to miss one, you're going to miss the Super Bowl that, that, that you've been looking for for the past 40 years. Um, I don't think there's, there's a race out there that's any bigger than coming to Crandon. I think people that come to Crandon, they see it on TV, they think it's the greatest race. When they come here, then they know it's the greatest race there is out there. And they come to this track and they're just blown away by it. And that's why there will be 50 plus thousand people here because over 40 years, people come and they keep coming year after year because they can't miss it.